Hello, Savvy Savers. Welcome back to our channel where we turn financial chaos into financial freedom. Today, we're tackling a topic that can change your life, creating a budget and sticking to it. So grab your notepad because we're about to make budgeting as easy as pie. Let's start with the why. Budgeting isn't just about restraining your spending. It's about understanding your money and making it work for you. It's the blueprint for your financial health. And without it, well, you're navigating without a map. Let us give you a GPS for finding your financial way home. Now let's dive into the how. First, list your income sources. Next, track your expenses for a month. Everything from rent to that morning coffee. Categorize them into needs, wants, and savings. Remember, honesty is key here. With your expenses laid out, allocate funds based on priorities. Your needs come first, savings second, and wants. Well, they get what's left. This might mean cutting back, but think of it as trimming the fat to build a stronger financial muscle. Let's not forget about the unsung hero of any solid budget plan, the emergency fund. This is your financial safety net, designed to cover unexpected expenses like medical bills, car repairs, or sudden job loss. Aim to save at least three to six months worth of living expenses. Start small if you need to, but start now. You can start with $25 per pay period, but put something into your emergency fund every time you get paid, it really adds up. Because when life rains on your parade, your emergency fund is the umbrella that keeps you dry. Sticking to your budget is where the real challenge lies. Use tools like budgeting apps to keep you in check. Set reminders for bill payments and review your budget weekly. Adjust as life happens because it will, and that's okay. You can also use the envelope system to make sure that you stick to your budget. In the envelope system, you simply put the cash for your living expenses in an envelope and write on it what it is for. For example, groceries may have $200 in it until you get paid again. If it gets spent, then you may get money from another category, but as each empties, they don't get refilled until the next pay cycle. This makes sure that you stick to that allocation. You might slip up and that's all right, don't beat yourself up. Budgeting is a skill and like any skill, it takes practice. Learn from your mistakes, adjust your budget and keep moving forward. When you use the envelope system, cash is king. You will find that it is easier to stop spending when it's hard, cold cash coming out of your pocket instead of swiping that credit card. And there you have it, a budget that works for you. If you found this helpful, hit that like button, subscribe to Morgansoft for more money tips, and share your budgeting wins in the comments below. Until next time, keep saving and stay savvy. Remember, your journey to financial freedom is just a budget away. See you in the next video.